Ukrainian President Petro Poroshenko is holding talks with German Chancellor Angela Merkel in Berlin today. Discussions about the fragile ceasefire in eastern Ukraine, including the deployment of EU peacekeepers, are the main topics on the agenda. Recent attempts to de-escalate the conflict in Donbass have proved difficult to implement. Militant forces are accused daily of violating the latest Minsk ceasefire deal, and with Ukrainian fears of a fresh militant advance within weeks, diplomatic efforts are being stepped up to ensure the truce is upheld held by all sides. Poroshenko and U.S. Secretary of State John Kerry are helping to coordinate such efforts. Kerry was in Russia's Black Sea resort of Sochi on Tuesday for meetings with President Vladimir Putin and Foreign Minister Sergei Lavrov. Speaking to reporters after the talks, the two foreign ministers spoke positively despite the strain on U.S.-Russian relations, largely because of the Kremlin's takeover of Crimea and actions in eastern Ukraine. I am grateful to President Putin for the significant amount of time that he made available to this discussion for his directness uh, and for his very detailed explanations of Russia's position with respect to some of these challenges and of the ways that he believed that we have an ability to be able to work constructively together in order to resolve these problems. Kerry went on to stress that economic sanctions imposed by the US and EU could be eased if Russia uses its influence to force militant units to uphold the truce. But for now, he said the violations of the peace are worrying. But I also made clear our deep concerns regarding the situation on the ground. Continued perceived violations of ceasefire in uh, Shirokina uh, and at the Donetsk airport, the continued arming training, command and control of separate forces. Meanwhile, Angela Merkel reaffirmed her support for peace efforts during meetings with Vladimir Putin last weekend, following Victory Day commemorations.